Hey guys, I am coming to you from our newest project and I'm about to do a walkthrough of the space. It's a three bedroom house that is unfinished and the owner wants us to finish it, tile and come up with ideas for different spaces in the home as well. We are taking on this project. So let me give you a tour of what we're looking at and then hopefully bring you through the process of points, well, this point to the end so let's go guys so i'm standing in the foyer this will be the main entrance uh, and when you enter this is what you see very high ceilings off the entrance is a bedroom which will be an office or guest space and it will have its own bathroom and closet and then here we have another entry which will be a mud room which comes up from the garage uh, the laundry will be here mud room area and possibly a linen closet and right off that area we have another bedroom with a bathroom and its own closet as well it's a pretty big space it looks small now because it's empty untiled and unfinished and then you walk into the main family area this will be or the plans say that this is a family room kitchen over here and a formal dining area here it does have a l-shaped um, balcony which goes off the formal living right and then we have a powder room set up here now this house has a basement so this was supposed to be the stairs which led downstairs um, so we have to repurpose this space and figure out what we want to do with it and off the family room we have the master or the owner's suite it has a balcony access to the l-shaped balcony as well and a lovely space for a bathroom and closet there's another space that i'm going to show you which is outside it's the courtyard it's it's really nice and that space is right off the family room so we'll be taking on this project in two phases phase one will be the more permanent finishes like tiling finishing the ceiling painting etc and phase two will be the fixtures and fittings and we're really looking forward to this guys so stick around follow along this journey what happened roy we still come out. Inspector Royal. <laughs> Mr. Royal is fussing. We are preparing for the big project in St. Elizabeth. And one of the things that we have to do is shop for the best deals and the most affordable stuff. So today we're on the road trying to get doors, toilets, and faucets, drains, things like that, that we really need to start or kick off the project um we already identified our tiles so we're going to swing by and just show you what we what we looked at um and well today is just a shopping day and then we're going to load up the truck <laughs> not this truck but load up the truck and head out to saint elizabeth with all of the things that we have bought trucks trucks um we do have uh, a few things that we're getting in St. Elizabeth because there's a family hardware there so we're going to get a few things there but majority of the things that we're getting for this phase is coming straight from Kingston yep NEMS hardware by the way yes. Saint <laughs> in Elizabeth. Junction, Junction St. Elizabeth alright so we're at Super Valley now Royal is getting impatient so let's go
Alright, so we found some toilets that hopefully we can find a selection from. See, so all of these are soft clothes. All of these are soft Okay. Um, this one isn't bad, but the color kind of off. And we're hoping to get an elongated front as well as uh, what else? You say you have all in one and separate? Yes. So what we mean by all in one is that the tongue mm -hmm. and the bowl is in one. So there's no separation. Okay. This one, this one is a two piece. So the tongue is separate from the bowl. Okay. All right. So let's look down now and see what falls in the budget. Because 47 is smaller than these are nice. Oh, but these are sweet too. Because the yes. tanks are small. Yes. And these are also two piece. These also comes with the jet in the bottom. That's a second hole. Okay. At the bottom of the toilet, that gives the toilet the pole flush. And it also flushes from around the ring also. And they're soft clothes. And they're soft clothes. No, but this is a good and price. And they're for higher than clothes. regular height. Toilet. Because regular, right, so regular toilets are 14 to 15 inches high. Okay. And these are above that. So Anne Marie has given us a listen on toilets. <laughs> so we just have to pick one. Alright, cool.
Our next video will give you a more detailed overview of what phase one entails and also give you a walkthrough of our progress. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.